Morning chaps, welcome along to the vlog. Looking at these, I think they've come out all right. So a bit of paint, watered down, a bit of acrylic watered down and used as a wash. And we've got that lovely timber effect. We haven't lost the character of the pallet wood, but we've taken down the tone considerably I think that's spot on so I'm going to decide which is the top and the bottom the left and the right and then we'll stick these on the worktop in here in fact I'll probably tidy up first and then we'll start to lay the letters out and have a look if we can get uh, an adequate way of fixing them essentially down one to go do you want to look at it so what I did in the end was I super glued the letters onto the backboard and then from the from the back from the rear from behind I came from behind I uh, put several screws through the board into each letter to hold it into position let's go up onto the fermenter so we can get a better shot of it check it out that's going to look sweet in it. I think it looks good from where it is. On the floor. So the S on shed looks a little bit low. It's actually not. It's in the right place. Uh, it's level with the H next to it. But it seems to be a bit taller than the other letters. So I might just fettle that around simply because of my obsessive compulsion to have everything correct but other than that I can't see any other problems with it I think I've got the spacing right it's pretty well justified to the left and right and all three uh, fascia boards slot together as you can see seamlessly I can't see the joint from over here so I doubt anyone will from the road it's there by the way just behind there and the other one runs behind the D so there she is. You can see she stands out as well from the backboard by 18mm, with it being 18 mil ply, no shit Sherlock. Uh, but I just think it gives it a little bit more depth and dimension and character, doesn't it? I'm a happy bunny, I really am. 
just hit the old thing. Oh, let me get my phone case. I'm going to bugger off home. I've got you on the, uh, the gimbal. So I'll grab the phone case. There we go. Lights out, folks. So, a bit misty in here, but I've just hit the whole thing again. Mm. With a uh, quick coat of water-based polyurethane. I'm going to leave that to... Oh my goodness, I'm forgetting everything. I'm going to leave that to dry overnight. Just flick these lights off. There we go. So, there's the two signs. They look good sat there, don't they, like that? I'm really pleased with how they've come out. So, I'm probably going to spend the rest of the weekend coming in the next few days just to hit these with some more gloss varnish uh, but that's it folks I'm going to bog off home catch you on the next one